one of an attacker's first steps would be active enumeration, scanning and fuzzing to discover any holes or vulnerabilities. After active enumeration, the attacker might then use a bot to perform a credential stuffing attack on an auth API, slowly cycling through a database of stolen usernames and passwords at a pace that wouldn't trigger a legacy WAF rule. Until, there it is, they get a hit and gain access to an account. Or maybe they use the findings from active enumeration to attempt a SQL injection attack. Now, as they gain access without even needing a password, the attacker can collect a user's name, the account number, and the total amount of funds in the account. Once inside, the attacker can attempt an OWASP Top 10 Broken Object Level Authorization Attack, or BOLA, by manually testing fields until finding one that allows a transfer of funds without rechecking credentials. Now, they can empty the account. But that's not the end of it. While logged in, the attacker might also use their previous information gathering to carry out a directory traversal attack on a vulnerable check lookup field. Now, they can log directly into the application server, 